Watch the entire video my lovely viewers, I mean from start to finish, to get the whole thing. Without wasting much of your time, let's get right into it. Hi lovely viewers, it's me again, your one and only Mtati Mpundu. Welcome to my YouTube channel. If this is your first time on my channel, kindly subscribe to my YouTube channel by hitting the red subscribe button down below and turn the bell icon to join the notification squad. Don't forget to like, share and leave a comment. Tell me what you think about this video in the comment section below. I'll be super glad to hear from you lovely viewers. Well, I like it, your opinion. Of course it's my opinion. Of course it's my opinion. What I say here is my opinion and um, other people may have their own opinion. And what I say here doesn't mean that, uh, I mean, I'm, I'm always right. No, I'm human. Sometimes what I may say um, may not be true, may not be, may not be true or may not be a correct position. Uh, I mean, I'm only human. I can never claim to have all the wisdom and uh, to know it all. No, I can never do that. And I, I don't dare even do that. Of course, I'm a, <laughs> I'm a stubborn guy. Uh, I push my point. And uh, if, you, if, you, if, you, if you don't push back, I mean, I, 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 I will run. So, um, I mean, this is just me. This is just me. If I don't make mistakes, I wouldn't be apologizing. It is because I do recognize that I'm human and sometimes I make mistakes. And uh, whatever I do, whatever I say, I'm a person that takes time to reflect on, on issues. Those who know me closely, they do uh, understand this fact that I take time uh, to reflect on what I do. I take time to listen I take time to, 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 to reflect on what I do or what I say. And I also take time to listen to, to others. Some of the things that I do, I mean, uh, as a result of counsel coming from, from other people. Yeah, uh, but it, it's true I've got this strong character uh, that uh, sometimes when you, you know, you, 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 if you have to advise me, you have to make a point. And um, yeah, <laughs> I, I push, I, I, I stick to, to my position. I'm not a person that will just, you know, gravitate to anything. No, I, 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 I take positions. And when I take a position, I mean, if you have to move me, you have to come up with the uh, sound, uh, um, you know, um, sound reasoning, uh, you know, and good points for me to take. I am, I'm telling you. There are a number of people that do advise me, a number of people that I listen to. Uh, I know some of you, I just brush you away. When I see that what you are telling me uh, is not making sense, I will simply brush you away because I also don't want to waste time. Sometimes we have this uh, misconception that as a leader, you have to sit there and waste time listening to crap. You even know that this person is not going anywhere. You even know that this person, whatever. I mean, and you want me to sit there and just to be listening to you. Come on, forget it. I'm not going to do it. But if I see that you are, you've got some point, I will, I will, you know, listen to you and heed your, your advice. And this is where I even start my presentation uh, tonight. My first presentation, my first issue is that one of our crises, I don't know if it's crises or crises or crises in this country, is that, uh, you know, our leaders are very difficult to advise. Our leaders are very difficult to advise. Our leaders want, you know, to be praised. If you, if you sort of like uh, are going in the, a different direction, our leaders, most of our leaders, they don't like it. You can only be friends with them if you agree with them, if you tell them what they want to hear, and if you lie. This is a big, big problem that we have. 
we had it in pf we also have it in the upnd we have it in the upnd where you have to praise and unfortunately for president Haka in the HDMI, it's even worse because president Haka in the HDMI, he he likes praises he enjoys praises he enjoys people like he, that muzungu you know the european union to, today i was watching on the news who is you know pampering him to say you are the best in the world to champion democracy you know he enjoys it when you know that president of um, what's this uh, what country is that one now um, is it uh, where he went recently israel he he likes it when he's no you, you you're the best guy he likes it but uh, you know i think he, we need to be humble we need to be humble that uh, you know we are we are just human beings President uh, Edgar Lungu also, frankly speaking, it's the same situation. You know, you have certain people that are close to him. And some of these people, I mean, from my point of view, they are actually a put off because they lie. You know, they don't tell the truth. Their job is to discuss other people instead of looking at, I mean, which way should we go sitting down, planning and everything. So this is one of uh, the problems that, uh, that, that we have. I am wary of this issue. And every day when I'm praying, these are some of the things that I pray for, to say, my God, can I be open-minded? Can I be able to listen? Can I be a person that people can easily, you know, advise? I pray for that. And I pray for, even for other leaders, I pray for President Haka in the Ichidema. I pray for uh, Edgar Lungu. I pray for all those. I pray for Fred Bembe. I, I pray for all the leaders. We have this problem of only wanting to listen to those that are agreeing with you or those that are thinking the same way that we, we, we are. But this, you know, takes our country back. It takes our country back. Some of you, like already I'm talking about lies, I know some of you have are, 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 are telling different stories about Chilifatayari today. I know a lot of you have. I'm sure there are stories. There are stories in the UPND. There are stories in the PF camp. There are stories in the Socialist Party. Are, I'm sure a lot of people are talking, but I want to. I want you to get it from me. I want you to get it from me. The position that you have seen me take. The position that you have seen me take in these last few days is, is not influenced by anything other than my own reflections, which I'm going to share tonight. My wife, what are you, just, a, just a cup of tea, please. Eh? Eh? Uh, no, 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 just, just tea. Mm. Thank you, my wife. So the, 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 the position that I have, I can tell you, they are coming from within. I have thought about them. I have prayed about, I mean, this situation. So don't be cheated. Don't be cheated, especially those of you who are not aligned. Let those who are aligned to whichever political party talk whatever they want. But you people who follow me, who follow me as Trifatayali, who follow me as the public lawyer, I want you to know. And tell whoever is saying, no, Tayali never must have you PND. Tell them, no. Tell, no, Tayali, whatever it is, tell them, this is just me. And I can be this radical when I go through things, I pray over things, and I come up with a position, I, I just go with that position. And at the moment, the position that I've taken is that I am not aligned to UPND. Don't be mistaken. I am not aligned to UPND. I'm not here to be uh, to parrot uh, or an agenda for UPND. No, I'm not. Neither am I here to champion any idea for or any agenda for PF. No, I'm not. I'm not. This is this is just a fact. Am I talking to uh, people in UPND? Am I talking to people in, in PF? Yes. 
those who are my friends, those who I talk to, those who understand me, I'm talking to them. Even in, in UPND, there are people who are my friends. They are my friends and I talk to them. Yes, those I'm talking to them. Even in PF, it's the same thing. Those who are my friends, I'm talking to them. Even in socialists, those who are my friends, I'm talking to them. I have not aligned, I'm not aligning myself to any political party. This is the first point. So, from now onwards, I want those of you, if you are coming to listen to me, listen to me as Shurifatari, not as one who is championing any, any, any agenda for anyone. I'm not doing that. I'm not doing that. And I'm going to explain why I'm not doing that. Why I'm not running any agenda for, uh, for anyone. And in this case, I know most of you, you are looking at, at PF, you are looking at Alewe de Lapo. I'm going to discuss it. Tonight, I want to take my time and talk about these issues properly. And I want you to follow me very well. So, given, I want to tell you that what is my position as far as the country is concerned? What is my position? My position is that things are not going right. And there is no any other way I can look at it. No matter how much, even if you were to give me money, there is no way I'm going to look at these issues differently. And uh, even just last week, I was talking to one of uh, senior members of, uh, you know, uh, uh, in PF. I was talking to him. And he was joking to me to say, are you going to defect? Are you coming, coming to us? And I told him to say, I can't come to you. I can't come to you. First of all, your party is full. Secondly, your party is full of cadres who are hungry, who are, looking, who, are, who are looking for survival. Some of the UPND members are actually suffering more than me. UPND has not done well to look after its members. This is a fact. You can be whatever, whatever, but UPND has not helped its cadres. And I was telling a very senior a government, a very senior UPND member, that you are not looking after your people. You have neglected politics. Politics took you into, into government. You are now in government, but the politics that took you in government, you have neglected it. President Akainde Ichirema thinks that presidency is, is bureaucracy. That's what he thinks. That's what Akainde Ichirema, Akainde Ichirema thinks that Politics, uh, uh, being president, is a bureaucratic job. No, it's not. It is a political job. A political job that is kept by the people around you. The people around you. If you lose the people, what keeps a president there? What keeps a president strong? It's the politics. You can't have a situation where you are a president and yet your cadres are suffering. Though they come here on social media to insult us and they say all sorts of things, but we can see how they are suffering. You can see how they are suffering. Just look at, you know, you see the poverty. Thank you very much, my wife. Mm, I'm burnt. <laughs> I guess I guess you are very happy about this. <laughs> I'm used, you don't usually give me what to So, you know, I just thought of, yeah. Anyway, so, I'm bent. Shush, man. <laughs> Can I have water, please? <laughs> so, this, and this, I'm saying, I'm speaking as Jirufatari. The UPND have neglected politics. They have neglected politics. President Haka Inde Ichlema has neglected his own people. His own people. If you just look even Balawa Mdalawa SG, Balawa Secretary General, Yama Mdalawa Mdalawa UPND, you can actually see, though he moves around, but you can see poverty around him. You can see poverty around him. The people that are looking good, my minister, Zishan Shani, but him as a Secretary General, you can see poverty. When she comes to talk on TV, I mean, she even, she's even failing to talk properly because 
I mean, she looks so poor. Eh? You know, Papa to land that song with a winner. Ufi the warrior with a winner. You feel the warrior, you know. And go and get check what you really have with a winner. Brain in our fast. You think faster and whatever. What but you can see how slow they you they, that's why that man makes so many mistakes. Bantuan can even have a secretary general of UPND. He makes so mistakes in his English, in his statements, because I think he is a lie. But you think, 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 look after your members, starting with your SG, going to the deputy, going to Shan Shan. This one is so, look at this one is so, this one is so is enjoying. And that's why this one is so is making so much sense. This one is so is making so much sense because this one is so, he has found a way of eating. He is eating and he's making a lot of sense. He can even realize that, ah, uh ah, -uh, Ungawadula, eh, can we work on this? He's even being honest. But these guys, these other UPND cadres, Avansala, they can't think properly. They can't see things properly. So, if you are talking about Insala from the point of SG, then you talk about Insala from to, to Kuliba, the deputy SG, then you go Kuliba, the members of Central Committee, Insala, correct. What about you, well, the social media? What can you tell me? What can you tell me? Eh? It is nonsensical to say no in politics. We didn't, we didn't come here to eat. We didn't come here to eat. Haka inde ichilema. Haka inde ichilema. Politicians, politicians eat from politics. That is just a fact. You can't run away from it. People who are exposed in politics, they eat from politics. They eat from politics. That's why even me, even I tell you here openly, open, it's difficult for people like me to do business out there. I must eat out of politics. But when you are in opposition, it's tough. But when you are in, in the ruling party, the ruling past must be able to find a way. They must be able to find a way. Of feeding its people, of looking after its people. I was in southern province for goodness sake. I was in southern province where Haka Inde Ichiremag was getting 100%, 100%, 100%. What is happening in Livingstone? Truth be told, Kulinsala, there is hunger there. There is hunger there. I met UPND people who were, who fought so hard, die hard. Back in the HLM, I'm telling you this. I am telling you not to embarrass you or whatever. I'm telling you the fact. This is what is on the ground. Your people are crying. You have neglected your people. And no matter what you say, even Jesus Christ, when that woman came to say, my child is sick, please come home and, you know, uh, cure my child. What did Jesus say? He says, I must first sort out the children of the house. I must first sort out the children of the house. And then the woman said, but no, even the children, even, you know, children from outside, they can eat from what is dropping down. That, that, that statement, that encounter, it can be very political, can be very political, where the ruling part must be able to at least, but have a new PND, what they get, they will be dropping down. I'm telling you. And that's what happened to Edgar Lungu. At least Edgar Lungu and our PF, they did well on this one. Edgar Lungu emphasized the 10%. And the cadres were getting those 10%, catching on 20%, 20%. They were getting 20% to all the projects. And that 20% is what was going down. Now, 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 UPND, now, but what is happening now is that by UPND, Abanawamunganda, they are the first one to be hungry. They are very hungry. They, they don't have food. I was in southern province. Kulinsala, bad, Kulia. Bad, not to Kwangala. Kulinsala. Eh? And I'm talking about cadres. Cadres. No, 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 no. So, I'm, I'm not losing my thought, you know. I'm telling you that I was talking to this. Senior government official, and I was telling him that you PND Mudin Sala. And you guys, you need to do something because you, you just have to. You just have to find a way of empowering these people. These people did not suffer for them to come and continue suffering. 
and with the way you are messing up, five years, you might go out. And when you go out, what will these people remain with? ministers, maybe you have done something. But these people, no. This nonsense of saying, no, 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 we came just to save, we came to save, it's nonsense. It's nonsense. Look after people. Look after people. So for me, if he panondi in chula, why should I join UPND? No, I can't. I can't. So don't be, don't be mistaken. Don't be mistaken. No, daddy. What, what, what? The party, who is going to give you money in UPND? Where are you going to get it? Where you, who is going to give you money? People don't have money in UPND. So where are you going to get Who is going to pay me? Eh? So think, think critically about that. Then some of you are saying, no, you, you have negotiated that your cases be dropped. Cases in courts are not dropped just like that. Cases in court are not just dropped like that. It's you who are naive who think like that. My cases are not, are not, uh, my cases, yo, uh, corruption, what, what, my cases are, I say, I've said something, you know, and I'm in court. It's not easy just to negotiate like that with me. No. No. I'll only be acquitted because I'm an innocent person. And trust me, I am not scared of being in court because I'm an innocent person. I have not killed a person. I have not stolen. I may just have said something that somebody felt, no, this is not right. But I don't insult, no. I don't insult. I have not killed a person. So why should I be worried about the uh, court cases? No. No. It is a respect, I explained it. It's a respect that I have for him. It's a respect that I have for him. And you know, when I went there, I actually found that the man is very good. The queen is very good. The people around there, they are very good. So I'm actually very happy that I did that. But I didn't do that for politics. I did that out of personal conviction. I did that out of personal conviction. And my wife agrees with me. Yeah, that's why she's even making tea with she, she's even making tea for me she stopped, she was not making tea for me now that I went there and apologized she's even making tea for me so it's not about politics it's not about me negotiating, I haven't negotiated anything there is nothing that I've negotiated I'm not, and I'm not negotiating anything Whoever I'm talking to, I'm just talking to them because they are my friends. So, that is about my position. Number one, that I've not negotiated. There is no deal that I've negotiated with the, with the UPND. I will continue speaking the way I've been speaking, telling them about their wrongs. I will continue doing that. Um, coming back to, 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 to PF, I've said it that this country is not doing well. And a number of you, especially you who are, some of you who are here, you have been looking towards the PF. A number of people, this is a fact. I know Valungu Vale Tamba. I know Anan Vale Tamba. I know you watch. Whether you are not watching tonight, but at some point you watch. And I want to tell you that, you know, because things are so bad, in this country, President Akainde Ichilema has not delivered according to his promises, which is a fact. And Akainde Ichilema can beat his chest as much as he want. Can he can he magnify himself as much as he want? He can be praised by Bazungus, by Americans, by whites. It, he can be praised all he wants. But the truth of the matter of Akainde Ichilema, it's what you found out when you went there. When that guy was trying to explain, before you, he was trying to explain, you know, the high cost of living. Eh? And you had to come in. You even failed to explain it even yourself. The guy on ZNBC, I don't know if it's ZNBC where they are, where I was. You know, the guy was trying to explain, ah, no, eh, we ne, azapi controller, what, 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 and you came in, try to explain it. Ah, what in the <laughs> you looked worse than him. I'm sorry to say. Why do I say you looked worse than him? You said, you know, farmers were not growing maize. Now we have increased the, the, the price of maize so that farmers can grow. That's what you said, Waka in the Let's be honest. Let's be honest. 
And like I said here that our leaders don't want to hear the truth. Me, I'll, me, I'll tell you the truth. Let's be honest, Baka in the Ichirima. When you came in, you found sheds of, uh, you, you found metric tons of maize. About 3.5 metric tons of maize in the sheds. What did you do? You opened borders. You exported maize. And that's how we ran out of maize. So what you said to say, no, uh, farmers were not growing maize because the prices were low. That is not true. We had bump harvest. We had maize in the sheds. You found maize in the country. So that was not true what you said. I'm not insulting. I'm talking from what you said. Eh? They were not growing. Now they are going to grow. And look what I can teach them. Look what I can teach them. You have removed subsidies. And unfortunately, you have seen that life is hard in the third world country without subsidies. Because Vazesco now I have a mama and can subsidies. But you have removed subsidies. And you have increased the bag of maize. So how will that reduce? How will that reduce the, the, the bag of, 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 of maize? Of millennium? How? Eh? How? Because that's what you're trying to say there. That no, no, don't worry. We have since we have increased a bag of um, a bag of uh, uh, um, a bag of what is that supposed to mean? Since we have increased a bag of maize, it means that farmers will grow. I agreed. So let's imagine, even if they they we, we have uh, we have. Uh, 10, 10, 10, 10, 10 million metric tons of maize in the country, it's flooded. How will the bag of millimu go down? When the input, you, you are more learned than me, yeah? you understand these things. If the cost of production is high, how is it possible that the products of whatever is produced will be lower? I don't think that will happen. I don't think that will happen. Anyway, I am talking about this point to, to prove to you that things are not okay because the cost of living is high. And this is, a, this is the truth. And those of those who are trying to say, you are scrolling, you are scrolling, you are scrolling. They are lying to you. Listen to me who is telling you the truth. There is no development that you can brag about as a president if the cost of living is higher if the cost of living is unacceptable to Zambians, you, 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 you should not brag. You should not beat yourself on the chest that I'm doing good as a leader. No. No. Those Wazungus are just cheating you. Those Americans who are telling you that you're best president, they are cheating you. Listen to me. I'm telling you the truth. The Zambian people are suffering. Your cadres are suffering. This is a reality. And because Zambians are suffering, that's how Zambians are now looking at PF, including myself, including myself. I have looked up to PF, and that's why some of you have been saying, ah, but PF, hey, you are a PF cadre, because I've looked at PF. And the truth be told, the truth be told, at the moment, the biggest opposition political party that we have is PF. That is the biggest opposition political party that we have. All of us, the rest of us, with due respect to the Socialist Party, you are doing well. But certainly, you are not anywhere near UPND. Not anywhere near UPND. Only PF has it. And that's why all of us were looking to PF. When I was talking about President Edgar Lungu coming back, it is looking at how he performed comparing to UPND. Comparing to President Haka in the And I'm like, I think, much as things were hard, at least he was better off. Hence me, go, uh, hence me going to President Edgar Shagwalungu to say, you know, Balungu, where Come back. And some of you may not know. Some of you may, 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 not, may not know. You, some of you young people here, you have been jumping around she thinks that she started No. We started this thing a long time ago. We started this thing a long time ago. 
I went to President Edgar Lungu not this year, last year. Last year, when I just saw things are going bad, I went to him. I went to him, sought an appointment and spoke to him. We had an, an, an extensive discussion over that. But at the end of the day, President Edgar Lungu himself said, no, I don't want. I don't want. When, when he told me that, that is when I came now to Munduvile. And he started pushing Munduvile agenda. Started pushing Munduvile agenda. Why was I pushing for Munduvile agenda? I was pushing for Munduvile agenda. It is because PF, at the moment, the only party that can compete with UPND is PF. And if we need PF to come back, we need a good leader. And Munduvile, up to today, Napanondelanda, I hold that man in high esteem. Even when I was talking about Alewe de la Po, Mundubile, I hold him at, with high, in high esteem. In high esteem. I mean, is 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 just what we what for me I think a leader should be. A leader should be should have a vision. A leader should be intelligent. Umunta what in Gawakana, what okay umuntu you is intelligent. A leader who has a heart. A leader who thinks of you. How do you know that you have a heart? A leader who really thinks, who cares about people. You don't need to ask him to say, Kunga ndata kuju wunga. Umu inefye. He will be like, Mshemu ikerisha ni kunga nda. Ah, na nguwa mfuwe so nyawe? No. Ah, tulifewu ino, tulifewu ino. Ah, no. I think, Senden kwa kamye mshito wunga. This is a real life of politics. To live a bar. To live a bar. Both you PND and PF will live a bar. You leaders who are in, in who are in leadership should be able to help out people. Should be able to help out people. It is a fact. You can't run out. This is a third world country. This is a reality that we are living in. This is a reality that we are living in. Leader fila kwa tomutima. Au fort kunganda kulifichitike leader afira kwata ukuipampansha wikereshani ona au fort kulifi ona au fort chan 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 ai pampansha akukonka tekoba tino he has to give you whatever whatever no 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 you can see the care and this is the care that I'm that I'm imploring on you baka in the HLM to have when you are having those meetings of yours, katushinga ni wa, 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 wa members of central committee, katushinga ni members of executive venue, waka inda ichi nema, do you look at them? Do you look at them? Do you see how they look? Do you see how they appear? Bale moneka shani? Do you think bale moneka inkanda kwa ni finde moneka? Eh? I'm not eating in government, but at least inkanda andile moneka we. But the leaders in UPND, Bawa fia wawu, tuluka kwa tuma street kids, kunzala. Ba UPND, ba haka inda ichi lema, look at them. So, mundu mila is such a person. And that is why. And mundu mila again, the other issue is, you know, engaging a person. And telling a person that's something that he may not even agree with. When I started talking about the Alewe Redapo, I went to mundu mila, I told him. Look at the situation. We need a person that can compete favorably. Favorably now, how can they achieve? Can we apply breaks on this agenda of yours? Let us push Edgar Lungu. Mundubila told me, no problem. You are right. I agree with you. And he stepped aside. Ndea mirondo lwe la mufwe kutu wafu makuta di Tero le tuata mpili ya shiri di ala ibuwe lirapo Na ndefo tuata mpili ya tuata mpili mula nduwa kwewa ti You know, tuale foku liyao whatever whatever We saw that things are not going right So that's how we went to ala ibuwe lirapo That's how I went to ala ibuwe lirapo Now The first time I went to Ed Galungu I can tell you That if Ed Galungu had said yes I think I need to come back. At that time, if he had gone into the sea, trust me by today, I don't know what it would have what would have happened to UPND. I don't know what would have happened. If Edgar Lungu went in 
seriously boom i'm i'm the president of pf and i am still in politics and i want to come back hey that time i'm talking about last year i'm telling you that is a time if you remember those of you who have been following me i was actually saying you know hh must resign hh must resign hh must resign kalaka narrative I was trying to open doors for Edgar Ngukoba Tinga sa ingira pom dala ngayari sa kosa HH resign HH ngayari kosa but Edgar Ngu said no they went and interviewed him about the prices he said you know things some of these things it is not because HH is careless and whatever 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 he supported the HH when I heard that I was like ah are you supporter ah na makali pa ah obviously uyu muntu zona zona is not interested is not interested and that's how we push the mundu the agenda and the issues of the conference and so on and so forth we went back to alewere rap i want to tell you the truth i've been singing alewere rap for how long i've been singing alewere rap for how long alewere rap grew momentum when I opened phone calls, wherever I went, people are saying, Alewele Rapu, Alewele Rapu. And thank you very much for supporting, for jumping on the bandwagon. You went on social media, you were singing, Alewele Rapu, you were dancing, Alewele Rapu, you were... Shan, shan. People welcomed it. People welcomed the issue of Alewele Rapu. You welcomed it, Mdala. It, it looked like, I mean, analogically speaking, you know what you have to do for a girl, huh? You know what you have Ero bonse wa fiash wa kuisha ni bonse wa sumi na bonse bonse sha fiyonse fiyonse fiyenda fiyomi. That's how alewe the rapo grew. Some people are telling me today, no, don't stop alewe the rapo na utsun kasa na chintu na chende la sana. It's true, and I know, and I know, and I know, eh? I know, I know, I know, and some people want to claim it. No, me wana tambira. I don't me I don't have problems with those nonsense that's that doesn't matter for me what matters is that we achieve what we want I have set up agendas in this country and they have succeeded they have succeeded I don't come up and claim to say it is because of me it is oh no I don't do that that's not my style Mdala. but I push things I push things I really push things I pushed the Alewele Rapo agenda and it grew momentum. What is my problem? What is my problem? I want to tell you what is my problem with Alewele Rapo. Let me tell you. Our Sungu Bevati hit the iron while it's still hot. Hit the, hit the iron while it's still hot. If you don't hit the iron while it's still hot, or if you don't grab the opportunity, at the right time, that opportunity will go. That opportunity will go. You know, when you talk about it, the cost of living going high, the cost of living, they get agitated. And if you want to do politics, that's the time to do politics. After some time, people get used. People get used. And once people get used in Dala, then you come and start telling them it is a it is a it is a non issue. It is a non issue. It is a non issue. You need to hit the iron when it is hot. PF and sorry to say to also to mention this, including Wa Ed Galungu, they are missing an opportunity now. Now and yesterday would have even been better. Yesterday would have even been better. Each day that passes, that opportunity is going away. People will get used. People will get carried away with other things. In politics, you have to take, you have to seize the opportunity. You have to seize the opportunity. Right now, people are getting used. Who is talking about the, the, the a, a, a fuel price? Tatuere. We are almost getting used. We are getting used. So tomorrow you need to find something else, you know, to deal with. 
So from my point of view, I will not lie, I will not hide to you, I will not hide to you. I'm frustrated that PF is not bringing in the machinery required. PF is not bringing in the machinery required. If you go back to a tomorrow, why is that you grade, you grade, you grade, you do this, you do this, you do this, you do this, but you look behind, there is no one coming. You look behind, there is no one coming. How do you expect to get power? PF. And when I say PF, I mean all of them, even those so-called candidates. Even Vaed Galungu is part of them, I'm saying. PF, they are not taking opportunity. They are not seizing the opportunity that this government is offering them. This government is making so many mistakes. And the PF is not taking opportunity. They are not. Vaed Galungu is not taking opportunity. They are not. When I open phone calls, they hear phone calls one after the other, one after the other, hammering, hammering, hammering. Trefo Avalungu, Trefo Avalungu, Trefo Avalungu, Trefo Avalungu, Trefo Avalungu. When will Valungu come out? When will Valungu come out? When will Valungu come out? When will PF take it up? Because it's only me. But PF, you have gone quiet. Let us not pretend about PF. Let us not pretend. Let us be honest. Are you telling me, Why haven't you come on board to say, Why? Why are you quiet? Why are you quiet? Why are you quiet? So, why are you quiet? Because people have been saying, But you know what, PF, you have been quiet. Including Valungu. You have been quiet. Because I don't want you to be mne savaila savaila. Awa ufin mu e tari ni e tari is unreliable. Ah ah. This is my frustration. You push, you push, you push, but no one is coming to support him. No one is coming in to support you. No one is coming in to support you. Why hasn't PF started talking about Ali Wellapo? Why? Why? Why haven't you come in to start saying Ali Wellapo? Why? Why hasn't Valungu stepped in and, and do some politics? Why? Why? What politics am I talking about? I'm not talking about him going Uhisange Finderanda. No. There are some politics that you can do which can encourage people. There are some politics that you can do which can encourage people. Politics, you know, that are smart. For example, just for example, just as an example, Chris Zumani Zimba, Chris Zumani Zimba is in jail. Chris Zumani Zimba is in jail for something that he has not done. He's inside there. And he's inside there because those who have, who have who jailed him, they have been targeting ECM. They have been targeting ECM. Let us not pretend here. Chris Zumani Zimba is there because of Edgar Chagwalungu. And if Ed, Chris Zumani Zimba is inside because of Edgar Chagwalungu, why can't Edgar Chagwalungu even make one statement? One statement. One statement. To, be, to, to talk about that guy. To push for his release. To talk about the, 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 the human rights of that guy. Why not? Why not? I'm very grateful. In our first lady, now you are telling me, I'm telling you, before my first lady, but my Esther Mommy, wherever you are, me, I love you. And I, I really, I, I mean, I didn't know you personally, but I've come to know you personally. You are a very intelligent woman. Very intelligent woman, very articulate. I'm telling you, a lot of you people don't know by Esther Lungu. She's powerful. I am very grateful that you went to see Chris Zumani Zimba at, when he was at Ibex. Mama, I'm asking you, I'm begging you, 
Again, go and see Chris Zumanzimba. Get in touch with the wife. Console the family. But that is not political. You are not a politician. I'm talking about soft politics. Smart politics. Valungu just making one st a statement that that man was his former 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 uh, economic advisor. And even now, I was with him when the police were cutting that gate. He was there. I know the nephew is also there. The nephew is also there. But we're talking about people that, you know, prominent people. Because when you speak about Chris Zumanzimba, you also advocate for those others. Make a statement. Why not make a statement? Why not make a statement? Eh? Why not even go and see Chris Zumanzimba Kuchifungo? Ichire kanya chinshi. Ichire kanya chinshi. What is stopping by Edgar Lungo as a free citizen to go and see Chris Zumanzimba, to go and show that this is his person. I know they will do, they will scamper around him, they will stop him and whatever, whatever. But that is the kind of smart politics that we are talking about. Why is Valungu just sitting there quiet? I know Valia Kunan Kanekulia, which was very good, Kudia, and whatever happened, it's good. But there are some, there should be some of these things. And I'm, I just want to be making some of these points. Soft politics. I mean, in some of these cases, let's face it, some of these cases, I'm also, uh, I'm also in court because of Balungu. Because of what I had said to intimidate me and whatever, whatever. That's why I'm being arrested. Eh? So, why not? Tayari ali mutu muna nikane papa uda njapa. Na isa mtu muna tayari. Vaka pokora wasa wanta wanta wauta uka wauta uka wauta uka. It gives because when you do that, not so much, I mean, I'm not claiming, I don't want to, like, I'm, 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 I want to get the center stage. I'm talking about, it could be anybody. It could be anybody. It could be given Lubinda is inside. It could be whoever. It could be whoever. At least it shows that there is a pushback. At least it shows that there is a pushback. But when you are just sitting there like you are in a hole, I mean, that's why now they will just be all over you. Your wifey, your children, what? I mean, so, if people, for the, for the sake of Valungu, they are being arrested, and Valungu is not showing interest, interest to help those people, if he's not coming in to help those people, how will others be motivated? How will others be motivated? Because some people think that, no, there will be a revolution. Who will think of, you know, going into the streets when he is seeing that, he, he, that there is no help. When he's seeing that even Chirufia Tayari, who is so vocal, who is whatever, whatever, he can be arrested and be thrown in and he doesn't even have lawyers. He doesn't even have uh, money to buy in Shima for lawyers. There are some times when we stay to court, the case is running from morning and in the afternoon. You break off for lunch. Avanch tira lunch, ma lawyers. Is that nice? Is that nice? Eh? No, I want you to know. I want you to know for real, for real. And that is just what it is. It is what it is. Ndala, I'm a lawyer, but I could start representing. But I could start representing court. But I'm not sure no why. Honestly. So how will I motivate others? Eh? How will I motivate others? How will I eh, get people to join in? I've got people. Some of these to my, to my videos that you see, I engineer them. This is a fact. Some of these videos that you see me posting, shan shani, utunimbo, I engineer them. And these chaps, when they do these to my things, they, you need to, to praise them. You need to give them carry to something. Eh? Ah, 
Nomba mdala. Ba kulomba. Bale kulomba 300 kwa cha. Ta ukwete. Ta ukwete. Elu wabuka. Ha mailo. Alebuwele rapu. Alebuwele rapu. He. Ba chipange ni kwa kalu mbola kambi. He. Iwe. Ubule. Ufale chitenge. Olo ushane sana. Une ngomu sana. Une ngomu sana. Alebuwele rapu. Alebuwele rapu. Umkashana. Afuale chitenge. Ane. 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 Asunisha boko. Asunisha boko. Alebuwele rapu. Alebuwele rapu. You can't give him anything. You can't give her anything. How can you motivate people? How can you motivate people? We, we need to be real. And this is the fact that I'm telling you. Those of you who are, no, that is not stable. That is whatever, whatever I'm giving you as it is. I'm giving you as it is. I'm giving you as it is. Eh? I don't want politics. I'm going to whatever, whatever. Kuti mwa ya poka maka kuri yaka inde ichilema like that. When are you going to get? Because you need time to motivate people. You need time to mobilize people. You need time. And between now and 2026, it's a very short time. Time to governize people is now. If there is anyone who wants to become president in 2026, if you don't come out now, forget it. We are going on with the, with the Aka in the H&M. We are going on with the Aka in the H&M. If it if no one really comes out, we are going ahead with that kind of chinema. You can hate me, you may say whatever you want, but PF, this is a reality. This is a reality. If you don't resolve this issue, it's either Balungu Bafume or Mundubida Fume, otherwise, forget it. Forget it. It's now. It's now. It is now. It is now. You can help me. I mean, after all, Tamundi Shamosti Umo Chimo Chivenakura Chura. So, whether Tamundi Shemo or whatever, Chimo Chinefi, but I'm telling you the truth. I'm telling you the truth. I know somebody would say, no, but why don't you go and tell this one? And why don't you go and tell Ndalanda? Ndalanda, I've spoken. I talk about these things. Eh? I talk about these things. I know some people are saying, no, no, no. If they come out, then they will be followed, whatever, whatever. Those are, those, that is being naive. That is being naive. If you are going to sit hiding in a hall, waiting for 2026, you think if they want cases against you, they wouldn't find the cases, even if you come out a day before. You think they wouldn't find cases. What is better for them to come and ambush you when you don't even have time to maneuver or to start now so that if there are cases, the cases come up and you deal with them before 2026? Why do you want to come and palast me in a terrorum case? Palast me in a terrorum case? It can't work. It can't work. Look at Nan Kane Udia, Udia Ni cancel. Eh, Ni cancel. You remember that guy, that, that fluent guy, eh? where Nakachinda went? They stopped that guy. He couldn't file a nomination. There was no time to do whatever, whatever. Just that there was somebody and they put somebody else. But Malange, where is he? Bowman, where is he? So that the a theory of saying no, can of a last year on case of Fuma, can of a last year on case of Fuma. Me, I don't agree with it. I don't agree with it. Then Pendrama points. Then Pendrama points. Number one, Nimi Evokovati. You need to hit the iron when it is too hot. Did I name it? When people are complaining, complaining a lot, PF needed to do something. PF needed to do something. Secondly, you need resources to support, to encourage people. You need resources to encourage people. All those who are coming up, we are late, but it's they are doing this, they are doing this. You need to encourage them. You need to encourage them. That's how politics work. And then they, there should be some, some support for those who are being arrested. For those who are being arrested, like Chris Zuman Zimba. Even now, Demi Konkomeshava, UPA, and PF. They were chest. You should go there. The people should see that you care for that man. 
you have neglected Chris Zumanzimba. Why have you neglected Chris Zumanzimba? Now, if you are neglecting Chris Zumanzimba your own, what about me? What about me? Echona inende chulila, inenda chula. Lawyers are not paid. Lawyers are by me in Shima, Kukot. And you want me to continue just like that? Eh? When I when I flip at you know, that is not consistent. No, 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 no. Think about that. Think about that. How can I continue? How can I continue? I can't. I mean, nishindi chipuba. Nishindi chipuba. Ayo kukosa. No, ukwate patience. Patience. Ama lawyers na mene wane fokudia. Ama cases ya chiri yale ya. Eh? Na ino nende fokudia. So patience udine nzala. Patience ama life takudi. Na waku shimisha ama life takukwete. Ame nishita ukwete. At your patience. Yo ukariamu 2026 inga tuambo kampena. Kwa riba. Takwa wewe fia ifyo. You must be alive to reach 2026. Otherwise, you die before the way. Therefore, I'm for moon for Then you have a fishing car. Then you have a fishing car because you are talking too much. Hey, daddy, this, daddy, this. I'm being real here. I'm telling you. Then at this point, you have to say, no, no, no. I can say from my palace. I can my palace. You won't have time. You won't have time. How can the HDMI is not stupid? How can the HDMI is not stupid? And don't think that Haka in the Ichilema we will give you power on a silver platter. Forget it. Haka in the Ichilema will not give you power from silver platter. No ways. Getting power from Haka in the Ichilema will be the most difficult thing that anyone who has become president has ever gone through. No one in Zambia who has become president will go through the difficulty through the uh, we'll go the, we'll go through the difficulty of getting that power from President Akande Ichinem, especially power and time, power and time. Hey, kuka wakimba na inama mume no. Te pa kwa ngala iyo. This is a fact. Mdala di landa kare. Ine ninji kala po pano. Eronka fumepo. Eh? Eronka fumepo. Aka wekele po. Aka le tu puma. You think you kutale kako? You think you kutale kako easily? You think I can be like a fat yoba isen piten piten go 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 go. You think you do that? At no, people will rise. How will people rise? When you are in Sala? When you are not motivating them? When you are not motivating them? Because for people to rise for you. But for them are motivated. Don't think that we don't have people. Don't be cheated. Don't be cheated that Chirufatari doesn't have people. Don't be cheated. You should be saying Chirufatari takwa tempia. Efomule landa. I can gather more people than Malema in South Africa. Some of you who are naive, you say, hey, Malema is powerful. Malema is powerful. He's powerful, Mambala and Kwatolpia. He's powerful in Guatemala. Malema was ANC. He was a youth leader. But epoca independence 1994, Malema was part of ANC. And they were grabbing properties in South Africa and nobody's business. Malema has got properties. He has got properties in Santon. Eh? He has properties, Mandela. And he has people that support man eh, that support no, at Mandela, eh, Malema. He has people that support him, big guys. I've been to South Africa. I've been to South Africa. I've spoken to to their to their Secretary General. I know what I'm talking about. I know people who are supporting Malema. They big him. They give him money big time. For him to fill up that uh, FNB stadium, it is money that he had. To fill up those people, those t-shirts, mdala inenda fano kui bangla t-shirt neka, eh? Just for me to make my own t-shirt, I can't even make a t-shirt for my own wife, eh? We have, I I have what I, if I had money in this country, somebody give me money. Kutina chisense ka muno, kutina chisense ka. Don't think our our politicians are shan shan shan. Why do you want to? Hey, Ndara. Hey, he's not even going to come. I have to make money.
Ti mwa mwena komdara. But I don't have a problem because God knows what he's doing. I think God wants me to develop. He wants me to grow. That's why he's not giving me money. At the right time, God will give me money. I am very sure about it. God will give me more money than I need because that will be time. So I'm not, I'm not worried. 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 I'm Habantu wa isa fulu kiri kiti kiri kiti. Ule mwona tiba isa fe china, besa fe, besa fe, ichi china mpofu. Nothing. My resources, if resources are there, you have people. Mwona ya mwona wa malanjinga wa kukoti. Kula, kula diva, na tujena di shutu shumoneka. Utu shitakava, utu shitakava ama, ama court cases. Tulesa. Majibi ya mga wali kukoti, ama lesa. Nomba ini, mbafe na andi wandi. Na eno ushiku, ushiku kuliwa boroko. Wasanga akushala yu. Aingina kumuliwa na nikale mumbi uku. Eh, first nko peko kusaidi uku. Na enda mwle kajamu anche kavi. Karieko kai hili kuna takuli. Eh. But I really thank Andy. Andy has been very supportive. I also thank va, va na nikale. Eh, va na kangwa. Last time she came and I felt so nice. I'm sitting there and I just saw va na kangwa coming in. I was very grateful uh, for coming. Thank you very much. So, kuti toilet tenye chichintango mela ifwe. Ngana tukwa tama afu. The point I'm making, don't cheat yourself for PF. Ukwe but no, tuwa likuwa tawa member, tuwa likuwa tawa member. And yet, these members of yours, you are not keeping them busy. You are not motivating them. Don't expect them that they will come and just sprung up when you call them. To say, oh, they're running for ma. Come. No, 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 no. You need to mobilize them. You need to mobilize them. Because right now, Socialist Party is chewing some of your structures. It's eating away your structures. Socialist Party is getting people because they have activities. Bapanga kwa workshop kwa ufi, abantu wa isabali ya kwenkoko. Dilavale ya baba pela kwa tuma 500, 500, yoka 500, ka 500, ka transport. Abantu wa mfuwa kwa wili. No mbae mwa PF, mwifi zi, awe, konferensi, awe, esha ni, esha ni, alebuwe le rapo, mwifi zi, fiance mwifi zi. So, how can you mobilize people? How can you mobilize people? And at this point in time, even na ma candidates, because kwa disa alebuwe le rapo, na wala ma candidates, hawa lefwa, wale funyako, tuma five kwa cha shan, 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 bali leka. Eh, bali leka. Because once wale wat, ah, Kairiba alungu wale wele rapu. So wale kwa kufinyako tuma ngwe. Wale eh? kwa kufinyako tuma ngwe. But for how long? This is real. This is me expressing myself. This is me expressing myself. You have got tama challenges mdara. Ii nepano. Nko ngole na dishpata. But this time around ni nko atenko ngole. Eh? And thank God. Wamo wale tambano kutamba. Kaka mwa echeka ethe. Unachika mwa unoka mwa unoka. Na hika kwa chisenko ngole kaefeo. Elo kama chikala tuka na kai. Ntina kati one day kaka ntuka pano nita sewa ana. Thank God. Inguluta shaka kesa mwisho kwa tika ntuka. Ala wansi nga kari ntuka. Na hika kwa chisenko ngole. Teti mbepu. Na hika kwa chisenko ngole. Na puka liya paka mwichi. Elo kala tuka na kai. Nga kari tuka na naroe sante shit. Kama wansi chaka nga kaku. Nga kari bega kani jimina. Nomba mdala. Elo mtu ambo kula kutuko. Elo kuna wikatati alevu ili rapu. Alevu ili rapu. Nani wala chita motivate. Who are you going to motivate like that? You can't motivate anyone. Eh? Waku ikatonka show wa amkula kongole ndana makuma ithopians wa wananko. Eh? Each time I'm arrested, my wife doesn't have money and she has to go and borrow money from someone. Whatever, whatever. Lefuma, oh nani kongole, I borrowed 1,500, whatever, whatever, mdala. Inwe. So, mumpele komu chinshi, mune mpela komu chinshi, nga mune wata wata. Eh? Na mule wata wata mule mpela kwa mchinshi. I try my level best. I'm not at your level. I go through bigger things which you don't know. Which you don't know. Mule mpela kwa mchinshi. Mule mpela kwa mchinshi. Not that you, hey, ujanchan, hey, hey, nama mpela, hey, tayari mpia, whatever, whatever. Yo kutuna kwa tenko ngole kuliyefeo, nga chakwa tivintu vili wino. Panda kama chikana nga kaza nda mdala Tika kutuka Hehehe Iwe Iwe
DJ Mutati exclusive. Savage. All right, that's all right for you today, lovely viewers. If you did enjoy the video, please don't forget to leave a comment in the comment section below. Tell me what you think about the video you just watched in the comment section below. I'll be super glad to hear from you, lovely viewers. Once again, I go by the name of Mutati Mpondo. I love you. Peace. I gotta go.